That's a cute picture. Hey, it's day, what day is it? It's day four. <laughs> it's day four. We just left Burger King for breakfast, obviously. And now we are going to the school to have lectures from for a couple hours, and then we're going to go to have lunch at a beach. So this should be fun. Why are they there? Our lecture already and now we are in Hurley's which is a supermarket food place here and we're in Cayman I'm not sure what part of the island we're on right now I'm no I don't know either I should ask somebody we're gonna make a cheese, <laughs> make a cheese. oh my god I want to ask somebody what part of the island we're on right now do y'all know what part of the island we're on right now no. okay <laughs> should I ask somebody that works here I'm gonna ask somebody that works here. I have a question for you do you know what part of the island we're on right now I have no clue what part of the island? Uh, Red Bay. Red Bay? Yeah. Okay, so it's like more east of the island or yeah. is it? Okay. 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 Thank you. I just wanted to know. <laughs> so we're kind of on the east side of the island right now, right, James? Yes, right. Correct. Correct. So we're about to get some food right now. to get some good eats. Some good eats. What part of the island are we on right now, Jonathan? Uh, town, Georgetown. We're still in Georgetown? Gardens. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> hey, it's been a while, but I've just been doing touristy stuff all day. We went to a castle, <laughs> and then what do you mean? And then, and now we're at the. And now it's your favorite bad bitch. We're back. We're here. We're fabulous. Look at these new shades. I know y'all fucking love, love it. Got a cursed dog. Uh oh. It's okay. Freaking love it. No one. <laughs> But now we're at the Botanical Gardens, so I will show you footage of that. And that's cool, right, Amari? What? That's cool, right? Yeah. I, I don't know what you're saying, but yeah. This place. Yeah, that, that's pretty. cool. Okay, bye. Sorry, I'm in my glasses. I'm sorry. Footage guys. starting now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we go. Pictures with that. So, the name of Kirkland Nixon is actually the first fire chief. Oh, you love him. You love him? He died. He died. <laughs> yeah, he needs the first fire chief like over 30, 40 years. All right, guys, wow. come on, let's go. We first low firefighter, low. Mr. Kirkland. We're here at the Botanical Park, and um, I had to go to the bathroom, so I got left by the group, so I'm alone. Let's see if we can find them. I don't know where they went, but this garden is pretty. It's pretty here. Bitten. Getting bitten by a lot of mosquitoes here. That's fun. Yes. Oh, hot. <laughs> and dying is cool. Ones, though, the government don't care what if you want to eat them, if you want to kill so them. Some people eat these. This one you go to jail. Oh, oh so these are the rare ones. This yeah, the blue, 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 blue iguana. The blue iguana yeah. is endangered. Yeah. 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 So it's, it's dying. Does she always stay over here? Yeah, he's the his me. I moved. Like, okay. like, <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Bye, Bye She said, I have to chill now. Because y'all really in the way. Thanks for the. Thanks for that. Yeah. I found my group. I was vlogging okay. alone. I was like, this is sad. I was expecting the blue iguanas to be a lot more blue than that. <laughs> well. 
That's life. <laughs> I am so sweepy. That happened to me. I went to go volunteer. Um, at All you gotta do is just break it open and eat it. Oh, There's cool. a seed inside, just put the seed up. Mm -hmm. So, this like a peek? Oh. Can we eat these? No. Yeah. True. The adventurous little one. <laughs> All right. No. Here's the tamarind tree. And outside, yes, the reason why the kitchen, <laughs> the reason why the kitchen was on the outside of the house and not on the inside of the house, that if the kitchen did burn down, it would be away from the house. That's good. Oh, smart. All right. Yeah. Oh no, I somebody asked Okay. Coconut is there. Okay. Here is the medicine garden part now. This, this, this tree right here is what fever grass is what we use for. Fever. 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 <laughs> Wait, what? Fever grass. That's fever grass. Fever. This is um. Works better than antlers. This one is called um. Ah, uh, what's it called again? Leaf of life. Leaf of life. This is the leaf of life. All right. So when you're sick, you're feeling bad, flu stuff, take the fever grass, take the leaf of life, boil it, drink the water. Does it work? Yeah, it does. This tree right here is the ironwood. The what? Ironwood. This is the ironwood tree. This tree is very hard to cut, hard to get a screen, and termites cannot get through it. Ew. So that was used for. with some stingrays and swim with them in the ocean. So this should be fun. vlog a lot because I just had a really bad time editing and trying to get it together so I think hopefully I might just post this when I leave the Cayman Islands. I was, I was hoping to post at least one vlog while I was here but 
you know how that can be. Um, <sighs> yeah, it's so beautiful. It's so pretty here. I love. Um, so yeah, we're just hanging out. We're just chilling. Yeah. Was it fun though? It was fun when I wasn't uh, choking on salt water. <laughs> I understand. Fun, Sophia? Yeah. Yes. I'm having the best time. Me too. You wouldn't think I didn't snorkel, but I'm literally living my best life on the boat. Hey. <laughs> Down the party, people. Do a little dance for him. It's our last day here. I'm so sad, but we are, we just left breakfast at Simboco and now we're going to the town of Hell which, in the Cayman Islands and I'm excited to see Hell. Don't want to go there for real, but it's fine. Oh, I'm so hot. But yeah, we're getting on the bus and going to Hell. Well, we made it to Hell, everybody. We have, there's, there's also a boy. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're in hell. We're in hell. What's your favorite? These are my TLC girls. Claire Patrick. I'm so dead. Beyonce. I'm not even beyond the bullet. Okay, so we're in hell. Um, hell got its name because of the rocks. They look. I guess someone one day just said, "Hey, these rocks look like hell," and then thus that's how hell came about. Let's look at hell. Are you guys happy to be in hell? Yep. <laughs> we're happy to be in hell. You know what would be funny if my band just started moving? And yeah, now we really dip out. Hollywood. Yeah, I guess this is hell. How old are these rocks? These are one, yeah, many millions of years old rocks that form together to look like hell, I guess. This is what they think, they think hell looks like. Okay, so now we are at the Cayman Turtle Farm. About to hang out with some turtles, and I guess are we snorkeling with the turtles too? I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know what we're doing. We're snorkeling at some point, but I know we're gonna hold torties. We're gonna play with the torties, and yeah. Hi, torties. Last tortugas. Yay! I do wanna feed that. These are cocoa puffs to feed the torties. Here you go, tortie. I like this one. He likes me. <laughs> Here we go. <gasps> Yay, you love me. You want to eat this stuff that I give you? Islands. As well, come to the Cayman Turtle Center. My name is Ben Delbert. They call me Benny. Now, folks, watch you Ben looking out in there. 
these are all our breeders. These are all the mamas and papas of all the breeders we got here. Presently now we got like over 9,000. And to tell the difference between the male and the female, the male has a long tail, the female has a short tail. Nesting season will begin from May till November. A female no one just breathes. That man made beach over there, most at nights. She'll dig a hole, lay her eggs. There's always a staff member around to collect those eggs. We collect her eggs, take them to that building right there. It's called the education center and the hatchery. And we put them in stay four boxes. It takes about 60 days before the eggs hatch. Now each year, there's a percentage that's released back to the wild and some are kept for research and education reasons. Now the center did start releasing turtles back in the early 60s and up to date now has released over 33,000 back into the wild. Now one female turtle can roughly lay in from 500 to 1,000 and the season lasts for six months. An average nest can be in from 80 to 120 eggs. Some of the turtle age in there starts up around about 20 to about 80 years old. And they say they can live like 150 of our reader knows. The weight is anything from 250 to 600 pounds. That was turning green bone and it was sparky. Center was first started back in 1968, and some of those turtles got names. There's Sparky, there's Buckshot, there's Leonardo and Donatello, we got Halo, Florence, Katie, Tommy, Shelby, Honey, Dot, Submarine, Smarty One, and Smarty Two. And why these are called green is actually oh, inner funny. body fat, the FAT. It is dark olive green. That's where they get the name green sea turtle from. Here, you guys feed them a while with that special made food. It's a high protein pellet, it looks a lot like dog food, but out in the wild they would normally eat seaweed, seagrass, and algae. Sometimes they might nibble as sponsors in general. Fish. Turtles get active. Zoom around here in two to five minutes. Gonna come up. Submarine has a white thing on the back. It's the only one that has a white thing on the back. Submarine. That's another experiment we did with Scrub Submarine. That's been there like 15 years. And if we decide to set her free, then we can attach that GPS track on her. Torties. And this is a, the first thing for Cayman was after Turtles, okay? 1503. I'm Mari with her cousin. It's coming. Kevin. Las Tatugas was the first name for Cayman. Yeah. And then the, the last name is after Cayman. Cayman is a small bird. I love when they come up and breathe. We got one crocodile over there and he's smiling. I'm obsessed with these turtles. Very, they're very cute. I love them. And the seasons are six months. So we're going to get ten turtles in the season. turtle farm we went to eat I can put a picture of my food plate below but um so we went to the turtle farm we snorkeled with a bunch of <coughs> 
snorkeled with a bunch of turtles and fish and the waters there. And then we came to the beach after we ate at a restaurant, at a waterfront restaurant. Yeah, so then we ate and then we came to the beach and we were just here all day. Hopefully I can put in footage of, we went on a banana boat and then we were just hanging out on the beach all day, honestly. So hopefully I can get footage of it. Yeah, and put it in. I'm pretty tired right now, so we're probably gonna eat dinner and hang out the pool. I'm vlogging. <laughs> Do you wanna be in it? I posted the first one about YouTube. You gotta watch it. Oh, Joe. It's so your... what's up, guys? I'm here with Sunny in the lovely Cayman Islands. We're chilling on the beach and watching a little sunset. You know, big up on a blog, you know. Hey, big up. Hey, food. big ups to you. Wagwa, yeah. wow, wow, say it. Wagwa, wow, wow, my boy. Hey, Wagwa, wow, wow, my boy. Hey. That's Big Joe. <laughs> so we're about to go to the hotel at this point. I don't feel like getting up now. I'm really comfortable here on this little day. <laughs> say that you are number one and that we really appreciate you um, thank you for making this a time to remember I'm walking towards you now since you won't turn around <laughs> thank you so much Yes and no. Yes. But, um, yeah, so we're gonna go say goodbye to the people at UCCI, UCCI for the last time. How you feeling about it? Um, oh, you talking to me? Yeah. Oh, I feel it's okay. sad. I mean, I want. I don't want to go home to stay. I want to go home to visit and then stay here. <laughs> oh, just to say hi to my family, but I'm going back to the Cayman Islands. Bye. Like, I wish that was real. Y'all got a passport now? Like, y'all can't tell me about that. Out <laughs> everywhere oh, I'm really for the next 10 years. I'm out. I'm really trying to go break. Actually, I have Actually, a, I can't. a Actually, commitment yeah. during spring break. I can't. Where are you going to spring break? I'm going to report at a TV station in Raleigh, North Carolina. Okay, we come on with you. Okay, come you on. can. Thank you. Oh, you okay. <laughs> 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 I know, I got all that on camera too. But yeah, right now we're going to say goodbye to our friends at the University College of Cayman Islands and then go to the airport, which is really upsetting me right now. <laughs> on behalf of this Communication Studies Intercultural Communications class, we would like to present you with a gift from Westchester University and thank you for all your time and effort you have put into us with this DNA project. We want to thank you so thank much. Thank you. You're number one. Because you're number one. <laughs> Yeah, so maybe we can get him one of the, this season, one of the pictures. Thank you. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, guys. So it's like close to eight in the morning, and we usually wake up or woke up rather every day at eight forty-five to meet and then go to breakfast and then do all of our stuff for the day. So everyone's probably either still asleep or still in their rooms getting ready. So I decided to just come out here a little bit early since I was up and get my last little glance at our hotel and our last little glance I came in. I'm actually really sad right now because who the hell wants to leave this place? My last little look around. I don't believe. Ah, I want to go. Oh, well. I might hang out in the hammock for a second. I am just sad as shit right now to be leaving this place. I don't want to leave, so I'm spending every moment I can with the water and with the sun. It's just beautiful, and I don't want to leave. I obviously have to go back home and then 
start my last semester of, of school and finish my degree and get a job so I could actually make the money to come back to this place myself and, and, and show my kids this place one day. But I always remember this place as the first place I ever visited outside of the U.S. And it was beautiful. It was really, really beautiful here. And it was just different. I feel like if I went to anywhere else, I would have, I don't know if I would have got the same feeling because I feel like came in a special. Out of all the Caribbean islands, I feel this is a very special place because, I don't know, because a lot of people, when I told them I was going here, they would be like, what's the Cayman Islands? What's that? Where is that at? And I would always have to explain to them where it was. So hopefully, throughout my life, I can be rich and get a beach house here and come and bring all of my friends and family for the summers and whenever they want to come for vacation just to get away and just so they can experience this place i'll always be thankful to westchester and the comm department and doctors anita foman and bessie lawton for bringing us little people here um to just experience this i mean it's just incredible and this has been like the best time of my life yo I had a really, 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 just getting personal, but I had a really, really rough winter break. I had a rough 2018. So this was really just everything that I needed to get away from home and to just be around like-minded people and to be in this island having so much fun and, and sightseeing and going to the beach every day and going to the pools every day and <sighs> really gonna miss it here. Don't wanna leave, don't wanna go home back to reality, but that's life. And I actually really can't wait to go back to school and finish, finish this drone out strong. So, I, my alarm came on at the end of that video. It was so good, but it's time to go home. I'm really sad about it, but I am ready to finish the semester, my very last semester ever. That's crazy to say. And it's really special that I got to come here right before my last semester of college. It's crazy that it's my last semester. It's crazy that I'm graduating in May, but I'm ready, I think, now. I'm ready for whatever life's got. And I'm ready to travel. I'm ready to leave home. I'm ready to learn more. I'm ready to be in different places. I'm ready to make new friends, make new memories make my own reality, make my own life. Isn't that scary being in control of your own life and destiny? Yeah, a little bit, right? So, yeah. Bye to my hotel. Bye to Grand Cayman. I won't be leaving. I'll be leaving around like three, but just saying my goodbyes early so you can see on video how sad I am to leave this wonderful place. This is sad. Brooke, goodbye. Goodbye, Grand Cayman. I'll miss you. Let's see how much I learned. I think that land over there is from point. All of this stretches all the way to like downtown Georgetown. Coming back towards Seven Mile Beach on the other side of our hotel. And then all that's West Bay. So West Bay was where hell was, the turtle farm and all that stuff. I know the island, I'm an island girl. This is upsetting. But goodbye, Cayman. I have to go. I miss you so. I miss the hotel. This is upsetting me. Bye bye.